A patient recruitment program earns money for a medical device company through buying back time, very simply. An accelerated enrollment program saves time, and that time is very easily translated into dollars in two different ways. One way is that a shorter time to fund a trial means more money that is saved on the actual fixed expense portion of a clinical trial because there are fixed expenses associated with running a trial whether patients are being recruited or not. Of course, the variable expenses associated with each enrollment are going to be there independent of the time it takes to enroll the study. The second way that time is monetized is by faster market entry. The sooner a clinical trial is finished, the sooner the product can go through the regulatory approval process and get on the market and begin generating revenue. In many cases, this will also translate into better competitive positioning and better opportunity to grow market share. So the overall goal of a patient recruitment program is to create value through capturing the monetary value of saved time during study enrollment. And every dollar that is invested by a medical device company in a patient recruitment program that has been well designed and effectively executed should pay back anywhere from 5 to more than $30, more than a 30 to 1 return on investment. This is the key rationale for a patient recruitment program, and there really is no other rationale. Of course, everyone wants to get their study enrolled as soon as they can so they can put a product on the market. Clinical people want to get studies completed, but the underlying rationale for doing this is generating a return on investment and creating value, which is really no different than any other business objective within a medical device company. It's possible to calculate the ROI for a patient recruitment program before ever launching the program. This spreadsheet tool has been created to show how to calculate the value of each patient. This is going to become important because when developing a budget for a patient recruitment program, that budget will eventually be boiled down to the cost per patient that's been accelerated into the study. So understanding the value of that patient is very important in terms of budgeting and making decisions on what level of investment will be appropriate for a company. Without going into a lot of detail, this spreadsheet has two sections and any of the numbers shaded in blue are variables or assumptions that can be plugged in. Numbers that don't have a blue background are calculations. Generally, the top section of this spreadsheet calculates the value of incremental market share from going to market earlier. The bottom section, that is titled Expenses, is where we capture the value of cost savings associated with shorter time to fund a study. Ultimately, we're going to capture the total economic value We'll net it out to a present value and divide by the number of patients recruited with the accelerated enrollment program, and that will yield the net present value of each recruited patient.